out. It's not the ultimate yet, but it is something for you to concentrate on so that you can go in samadhi easily. And the light and the sound also help you to concentrate easier. Of course, not all of you that I know, because when you've grown up already, you're too preoccupied with so many things in this transient world. Very difficult for you to go inside. But at least, you know, now and then, huh? Whoop, there's a light. Okay, okay, concentrate more for more light. Gone. <laughs> when you're too eager to catch the light again, it's gone. <laughs> Luckily, the sound is always there 24 7. And that is your uh, rock to lean on, okay? It won't leave you. Even when you're unconscious, the sound is going going on still to help you, to help your soul, to help your consciousness. Help you in every way, okay? Yeah. Unless it's your time to go, even in accident, it helps you to lighten the, the impact of the accident and help you in many ways, daily, even if you don't know it. Yeah, you don't know it. Otherwise, you will be kneeling all day, 24 hours, to thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. For you did that for me, did this for me. The Master Power, the light and the sound, always helping you. And we are very ungrateful indeed, because we don't really realize too much about it. Some do, some don't, and sometimes we do, sometimes we don't. But it's always there for you. It's our true self. It's our Master.